Greetings, travelers. Motion sickness notice to everyone. The game manipulates the camera to give the feeling of being on a moving ship while we recommend that they've their cap enabled. The camera effects can be reduced or completely disabled in the options menu if it's causing discomfort. Okay, lovely. I'm not gonna change anything just because of the video. Otherwise, if I was to play it for myself, um, just remember it's right here now. I would probably go with this. Maybe a bit more like this. Since it's for the video, the visuals have to be I mean it has to be more visible right otherwise it's too dark anyways what we're playing right now is um, I'm seeing the figure right here I'm uh, we're playing a game called Lazaret I think that's how you pronounce it um, from what the steam page says Lazaret is an atmospheric first-person horror game you play as a member of a rescue team called out to investigate a distress signal coming from a ship that disappeared four years ago so with that in mind let's get right into it let's save those bastards four years ago a ship called the MTS Endurance disappeared on its voyage across the Atlantic Ocean it has recently re-emerged you are a member of a rescue s crew sent to investigate a distress signal coming from the once lost cargo vessel. In the harsh weather conditions, the rescue operation went awry. You are the only member of your team who made it onto the ship. You head below deck to look for any signs of life. Even though you know that you're just the only person alive, and you probably will not be for too long. Soon, you shall become part of a crew, part of a ship, part of a crew, part of a ship, part of a crew, part of a ship, part of a crew, part of a ship. Help me! I mean, you can crouch quite well. That's the outside. I don't know what this is then. I know for sure that I'm seeing water outside. Also, if I could crouch that well, holy. Holy hell, man. Holy hell, Mary. That would be some good, good legs. My legs aren't that good. I'm just too old. Uh, there's the first uh, mannequin. Just stretching. Preparing to sprint at me at full speed. Probably knock me out cold. And then sit on my back. Prevent me from moving any further. What's all these sounds? It's like somebody's pulling chains or something. Insert. Oh. You do realize I'm the master of lock picking. It should take some time. Hey. We're in no brush. <laughs> if there was a limited time of um, moves, maybe I wouldn't be so confident, but since it's no limit, nah, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> It's probably a paper that says what the code is. Actually, not that stupid to go through all the possible combinations because there's way too many of them. Where did I come from and where do I have to go to? Uh, 
I cannot go to the elevator. Okay, lovely. There's a corridor that's dark. Probably a bit spooky. I don't know which fire extinguisher. Yeah, I think we need that. Oh, I can open this door. It's locked. I'll need a key for that. Then let's go downstairs, shall we? Let's go deeper into this rabbit hole. Nothing good's probably gonna happen. It's gonna come out of it. Why would a, a ship have changed just Why would it have changed just hanging down? Hey buddy. You became part of the crew. Part of a ship, I see. Those are probably like shells or some, something. Oh, look at my gloves, I actually have hands. So, I, the only thing I'm missing uh blood. Yep, just turn around and run out. I mean, that's what I would do. Why is there like a sign saying fire extinguisher and not like escape this way if there's fire? It can't be broken by hand. Holy, look at this guy, he's like a mummy. Okay, there's gonna be no hiding, that's good. Oh. 1947. Oh. Um, as I was saying, there's gonna be no hiding in this game. Thank God for that. Maybe run. Oh. You know, I didn't see you, so the scare kind of failed. And now I'm not going there. I need to use the code to open the. This guy gonna jump? I cannot sprint. Maybe they'll allow it later. But as of right now, I cannot sprint yet. So let's just calmly go back upstairs. Um, use. How the hell did I know where exactly to go? Am I... Am I dumb? I usually wouldn't remember this. Oh, thank you. I, I needed exactly this. Anchor relic. Still in the relic now. now I can escape this place. Maybe I could sell the relic. This could maybe fetch me a good price. Put it in the museum. Where it belongs. It belongs in the museum. Yeah, don't you do not fooling me, buddy. That's a great costume. That's a great costume. 
bullshit. You know what they say. Better start crawling. How are you that good at this? How, how do you pull yourself backwards with your feet? You gonna jump on me? The same way that the um, the guy jumps on you on in the Outlast? No? If only I could pick a hammer, I would break your skull. To smithereens. I don't know where the hell I have to go. You have anything for me? No? I'm hearing somebody walking. Please enter the room so it doesn't look like I'm stupid just hiding. Yep, I knew that's gonna happen. Swimming. <laughs> Am I okay? Am I okay with whatever is in there with me? I gotta say, this one is already doing much better job than the other two games that I've played before this there are two demos to be to be more exact to be more specific do I have like acid or something? no? maybe a pickaxe a hammer Sledge out. Oh, hello there. What have you got? A fist. A fist bomb. Oh, yeah. Wait. I thought this is stone. Yeah, no, you can keep that. If somebody attacks, I'm just gonna. Yep, they just introduced sprinting. This is always great when they give you the sprinting. Who am I going to be running from? Have you seen anything spooky in this game yet? Staircase key. Stairwell key? I don't remember what the key was for. I have to go towards you, don't I? So where exactly does the key go?
Right here, of course. So, the bad guys shouldn't be able to follow me here, right? It's a loading screen between us. They can go through loading screens. And another one just standing there. Medicine lure. Oh, it's two of them. So what are you looking at? Nothing? Huh. Can't go downstairs. Can't hide, so that's good. Yep. I'm going, guys. I'm going. Wish me luck. This isn't really burning, this is just like a normal pace. Where this is like a slow motion pace. I really don't know what you're all what you're up about. Yep, take the crowbar, don't worry about it. Boop. Quarter of Freeman! Freeman, you fool! You just gave me a weapon. How do I use a crowbar? What do punks want? I can defend myself now. Better be scared of me. I can whack your heads in. I saw you. Question though. Did you fall down? Hey, don't get me wrong, okay? That was a nice... That's a nice movement, you know? Nice, smooth animation. And you can achieve something like that. You're doing it right. This is like Metrovania, isn't it? You have to backtrack a lot. Don't really remember where exactly... Actually, I do. Why do I remember stuff that well? Dang it. Hey buddy, we meet again. I didn't want to do this, I have to do it then. It was locked for a reason, but no. The statue started to appear on the third day. It was just one of them at first, but more would show up every day, and by the end of the week there were dozens of them. Okay. Multiple pages have been torn out. Some of the statues have started moving. They're killed. They've killed three people already. When evacuating the quarantined areas, I whistled to get the crew's attention, and one of the statues whistled back. We've only had one more fatality fatality in the last week. The sent the sentence statues. Wait what? We've only had one more fatality in the last week. The sentient statues will always whistle back and it's proven an effective way of avoiding danger through the though they won't respond if you're too close. Still I think it would be best for the rest of us. To find a safe place to hold up for now. Multiple pages have been torn out. 
there's not many of us left now. The engines have stopped, but we can't get to the bridge. There's something else on the ship and it stalks the corridors looking for survivors. The safest place for us right now is in this room. I just hope we're rescued. Rescue I just hope we rescued them. A flashlight. That'd be the guy. Do you know how to whistle? Is there a whistle button? Um, control. Oh, there is. Oh, this is great. I love it. Oh yeah, too close to this guy probably. Oh, mamma mia, you know my family, <laughs> my familia. Roberto did something stupid again. He went back to with Camilla and they are not returned home. Please, Mario, help me. Where was this? I remember some other game used to this similar thing. I think the one where you whistle and the statue whistles back. Mm. Unless I've, I don't think I've played this before. So where was it? Ah, there he is. Yeah, I can't whistle just because the mic would just pick it up oddly. It was this guy, he was responding all along. He's like, oh, oh. Oh, a new one. So we're still looking for... Well... Anything really. Trying to figure out what's next. This is I think the beginning, right? I started here because I was looking through this window. Of course they won't let you out, even though you just seen mm, and read some awful stuff. I think like when you're the only one alive of a rescue team, I think your priority should not be looking for other survivors, but instead to try and save your ass first. No? Don't you think that's reasonable? My goddamn nose is itchy. <laughs> uh. There's nothing else here, so maybe we have to go back in this place. 
got a flashlight, so you know, maybe I missed the place that requires flashlight here. I don't know. Just trying to figure stuff out as we go. Oh, I was right. They're not responding, am I too close? Sorry guys, let me just check something out. Ah, it works! Oh, that's deep. They're like, hey, turn off that flashlight, please. I can barely see anything. Can be opened by hand. This guy's hurt. I just pretend to be one of the statues. I should be fine, right? It's a place to hide. So if I understand it correctly. I thought this guy moved for a second. How many f The longer this is going, the more I feel like I'm starting to feel the uneasy, uneasy feeling. So I've just made a circle. Meaning I've checked half of the places already, that's good. Nothing's there. Yeah, there it is. Why can I not remember? What was it? What was the whistling? Back to this room? This is the new part then, I guess. Wow. I have to keep on going. Yes. There it is, finally we see who's... Somebody with a flashlight, so I should be able to spot them. Let's get a look towards the locker, right? Seems like some... Well... He's the first guy at this... He's the guy that started the crew. The first member of the crew. And all that. So yeah, it's a clock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I have to figure another key. A lot of puzzles. 
I'm not just playing boring puzzles, but puzzles with some thought put behind them. Has to be a way to move this, right? It has to. I think. I'm missing something. What am I missing? What am I missing? Locked. How does one unlock it? All the statues have gone quiet, nobody's responding anymore. Why is that? I started doing circles because I don't know where to go. Missing. What am I missing? There should be something here. I cannot take this. So I was thinking, probably missing something, right? And then I thought, I think I saw a clock somewhere. The clock. The clock says 11.35. What if the password to the box is 11.35? Could be quite smart, right? So let's try that. It was on the maze balls. Oh, screwdriver? What am I gonna need a screwdriver for? Oh, the vent! The guy's huge. I thought he was. I mean, I knew he was big, but damn. There we go. Another room filled with blood. I'm guessing he cannot crawl through this. Moon, I'm gonna need that for those doors. And uh, I'm 
gonna need that for the other door. This unlocks this door. Oh boy. First things first. Try to remember. Have to go this way. This is the new door. Maybe I've just done a circle. I'm wondering, is the, the roaming guy just scripted? One more moon left, right? Or is he actually like roaming? Is it just a scripted event that just shows up? As, as specific times now we have these images I don't know where exactly this is but yeah can we go again? I think I know which room that is. Oh! I don't know what the hell just happened, I thought I... No? I thought I knew which room that is, but... I don't think I do. Yellow and then green and red. Yellow, green and red. Is there like a room upstairs? There's the one. Move, okay. Press. And there's a sun. Alrighty. the other corridor then. This way. I'm starting to lose myself, there's way too many. You're giant! And I think I'm dead. Who are you? What are you? Here you go, man. 
He got me good. Got me fair and square. What? That's different doors, but okay. Run. X gonna give it to ya. Oh, you gonna give it to ya. X gonna give it to ya. He's gonna deliver to ya. Knock, knock. Open the door. It's me. Fuck me. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> what were you trying to do? X going to live to you, dog, dog. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, ah. Thanks for playing the Lazarus demo. We're hoping to release the full game. Early in 2023. That's already far, far gone. If you enjoyed the demo, consider wish testing the game on Steam. Uh, I'm gonna say it like so. Up until the last moment, the last, say, five minutes, it was great. Then it just felt rushed. Just felt like they started running out of time or something. And just started throwing um, shit together. Basically, the, the giant that, that follows you. I don't know. It was great up until the moment where it starts chasing you and you go into way too many cutscenes where you're opening the doors or something and he's standing behind you waiting for you to open the door so he can grab you then and hold you up in the air and then throw you. I mean other than that the game was great, the game was great, it was nice, it was good, it was... It was good. The ambience, uh, the atmosphere, everything was spot on. Maybe a bit too many random sounds, but the, the whistling. Oh my god, I cannot remember where exactly I've seen this. But this was perfect. If only there was a, another, like a function of souls with this whistling. I mean, I guess you can use it to draw, like in a uh, draw map in your head, knowing uh, knowing where the statues are. I don't know, but as I said, yeah, the game was it was fine. It just. The ending of the demo was funny. But hey, that was Lazaret. So, hope you enjoyed it. I didn't enjoy playing it. Um, whenever the full game gets released... I don't think the game is out yet. No, it's not. It says coming soon. Who knows when that soon is gonna happen. So... Thank you all for watching once more. Stay tuned for more. This is a Shocktober after all. And goodbye.